Welcome to Red V TV, supported by Chapel House for the 2023 season. As we continue our build up to the new campaign, and with four days to go until Saints face Penrith in the World Club Challenge, it is the turn of Mr. Testimonial. It's our number four, Kevin. It's Mark Percival. And Mark is proudly sponsored by Able Sky. Able Sky are a truly independent office furniture dealer. They source, supply and install a complete range of furniture for all aspects of an interior project. There we go. And the the based in Warrington, if you need to know. Well, listen, if you're from Warrington, you want to be linked to the champions and a winning team in some way, don't you? <laughs> yes. Um, Mr Percival has had his injury problems over the last couple of years. Um, the one last season was a just a freak one, wasn't it? Um, yeah. Which needs nothing but rest to get over. And you hope that he's going to be over them and he's going to play a lot more this year. But listen, he's currently playing the Sean O'Loughlin role where you get dug up for the big games. <laughs> and when he does come in, it's like he's never been away. He's, he's just... A Rolls Royce of a player. Um, you can go three months without playing. You put him in for a final, and he just performs. Yeah, he's he's a big game player, isn't he? He just is a big game player. Um, I see you. You look at his performances in in the finals that he's he's been able to play in, and you're right when you call him Rolls Royce. He's he's such a classy centre. You get the the boring old shouts of people who don't know anything about rugby league saying that he doesn't pass to his winger, which is absolute rubbish. Um, he's he's kind of changed his game to that big, running, Tommy Makinson-esque back who has absolutely no... Um, no um, Self-preservation. That's the word I was just going to say. Self-preservation for his own body. He runs it in at full pelt and gets up, <laughs> shakes himself down, and goes again. Um, and we miss him when he doesn't play. Um, you only have to look. I say he's good in the big games. He's good in local games as well. When we played Warrington, he scored that try, which I think is the happiest he's been because, as he said himself, he was happy his hamstrings held out. Um, but also the happiest that Saints fans have probably been for him because it was... He scored important tries in finals, but that one kind of it just banished any doubts that he should have in his mind that he can do that still. Uh, plus, it was great play being able to switch the ball and fend off and uh, knock Stefan Ratchford over and uh, get past Ben Curry, I think was the other one, and slide him right in front of all of us. Is it fair to say that a fully fit Mark Percival is the best Super League centre? Yeah, I think. Um, Obviously, people will argue Harry Newman, but Harry Newman has his injury problems as well. Um, I think there's a, a couple of decent centres out there, but a, a fully fit Mark Percival is definitely, definitely up there. Um, he's the best, if not one of the the top two, uh, definitely. Um, he's so classy. He's got a range of, of, of different styles where he, he can just pretty much be one-on-one with his own centre or dragging the winger in him pop it out to the wingman. He can run it in hard. He can score full-length tries. He can score short-range tries. I mean, think of one, was it the whole of a couple of years ago where Farge kicked it over the top and he managed to bat it back to himself and put it down right on the line? Unbelievable athlete. Yeah. Um, we just hope, cross our fingers more than anything, that he can get a good 2023 under his belt. Um, because the more Mark Percival is in the team, the better for the club, just all round. Yeah. It's just, a, it's a joy to watch the last. And it, do you know what? I sometimes think he's underrated by our own fan base. Yeah, same. I do. I do. But you're right. That, listen, if, if Percy needs rest for this injury, if it comes to it that he needs a, a bit more rest for this injury, rest him. Get him right. Let him have the, the time off. Especially at the start of the year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have him have him ready f- towards the business end. But there's no point there's no point pushing him through 
if he if he doesn't need it and he can play, brilliant. But we've got that strength in depth. We ju- just spoke about it yesterday with John Benison. We've still got Will Hopwarty and Tommy Makinson to come. And we've gone through all the kind of what you call the three quarters. I suppose Jack Wellsby could be one of them as well, but you want to stick him at fullback as much as you can. But we've got so much strength in depth that at the minute, we don't need to push him in the early rounds if he if his body's not quite up to it yet. I mean, we don't obviously know. If he's fine, if he's absolutely fine, then yeah, get him in. Because he, he is one of our better players and he's the, he is the best centre at our club as well. Personally, I'd play him against Penrith and when the team fly home, I'd say, have a couple of weeks to yourself, Mark. Yep. Don't be flying home to a new baby crying. <laughs> you 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 go and get on a sunbed and just FaceTime your missus. She'll be fine. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm sure she'll love you for that. <laughs> Mrs. Yeah. Percival's gonna be my front door was trying to strangle me soon. <laughs> but yeah, and that's it. You, you Aaron, mentioned it Aaron, um, Aaron, Aaron, Mrs. Harrell are gonna be forming a uh, a club. To not let the team go away again. <laughs> yeah, probably, probably. But as as we're going to say, like you, you mentioned it right at the start, it's his testimonial year this year. Be good for Saints fans to get behind him, like they have done with the likes of Johnny Lomax, with Alex Wormsley, with Tommy Makinson, with Louis McCarthy, Scarsbrook, and James Roby back in the day. Um, it's good for him to get behind him. And hopefully we'll publicise his events as well that are on. Um, and he deserves it. I think he deserves it. The only my only issue with it all is it doesn't half age me the fact that Mark Percival's been playing for Saints for ten years it makes me feel even older than I usually feel. Especially when you're in the jumpers that are still ten years old. Yeah, exactly. Probably from uh, from his early days. These aren't they? It's that ISC quality. It doesn't uh, break down. Let's not get our fans talking about the, the quality of kits and the merchandise. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe and we'll catch you tomorrow for another episode of Revy TV.